Alrighty, so I figured to do a book review today. This is going to be a short one. This is the uh, 2010 Force Unleashed 2 Collector's Edition Hardcover Official Game Guide for the game. Star Killer on the front. It is embossed slightly. On the back, Star Killer and Vader. And this was the one I bought that was sealed. This was the limited edition print number eh, 33,737. And this is the slip that came with it that shows you what you can get in it. So I'm not going to go through the entire guide, okay? So there is the front of that. But I will show you... Ah, table of contents. So this is what is all in this book. If you buy this, if you decide to buy this. And watch this on your TV because I'm only doing the uh, art section that you get. And this covers all three consoles. Xbox 360, PS3, and Wii. And that is it. So, I'll go over some little things in this, okay? So, in here you get Nemoidian notes that uh, give you details and whatnot. Oh, there we go. These boxes. Nemoidian notes, Cloner's Caution, Jedi Wisdom. Jedi Wisdom gives you that. Cloner's Caution gives you that. Nemoidian notes give you that. And those will be throughout the entire book. Just an FYI. Well, there we go, I'm already up to it. There's the trophies and the art gallery itself. Okay, so right off the bat, I fucked up. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, this art gallery, it's okay. It should have been a separate setup, honestly. It should they should have released, you know, like a separate art book like they did for Force Unleashed One, which I haven't done a review on yet. But um Yeah. Like I get throwing it in the back of the book, but honestly, as big as these are, they definitely deserve a lot more you know, they should be in a bigger book. Because I've played both of these games. They're absolutely outstanding games, despite how people feel about uh, the sequel and whatnot. But, like, when I played them, I was able to get all the artwork unlocked for the most part. And setting it up as a wallpaper on my, three si on my Xbox One... Dude, it looks phenomenal that way. So, yeah, this should have been in a separate book. Do I love this artwork? Of course. It's beautiful. I love my artwork. I really do. All the artists that were involved in making this happen and the art director really went all out with this. I love it. It's just a shame, like I said, it's a shame. <clears throat> so, yeah, but this is a good book. I only paid about 13 for this, give or take, on eBay. And this was sealed. <laughs> yeah, it was sealed, but I took the cellophane off so I could look at it because I wanted to read it. <laughs> And see the artwork. That's exactly why I bought it. Because I love the artwork. So. But yeah. The artwork in this. Absolutely great. So. It's just. I don't know. I hate when they don't do like a separate. Setup for it. Which they should have done. Yeah. I do want to replay this eventually, I just haven't gotten around to it, because I've been busy with Gears Judgment, and other shit. 
So, yeah. Plus, there wasn't a whole lot. I think Force Unleashed 1 was a lot more fun than 2. But, I liked them both. I never played the Ultimate Sith Edition, because... I never bought it. I didn't even know it. I didn't even know it existed. Or I did, and I don't remember. I don't know. But eventually, I'll buy that when I have the money. And we're yeah, coming up on the end. And there is the back cover. So, that's it. <laughs> so, if you decide to buy this, it's really, it is worth money. It's for 192 pages. It's not that heavy. It's pretty light compared to other ones that are, you know, a little bit thicker and more rectangle and whatnot. And plus they have more space. <laughs> so, yeah. So that is what I have for today. So hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. So uh what am I to you and friends? Definitely. If you like Star Wars, if you enjoy oh, and it also covers PC as well. If you enjoy Star Wars and games, definitely up your alley. If you like art books for art, definitely good inspiration for you. And it's also great for your collection. If you don't like any of that shit. That's cool, too. I can respect that. Totally understandable. So, yeah. So, I will catch y'all later. Till next time, like and subscribe for thoughts and prayers.